Humanoid robots have long promised to revolutionize our lives. We've seen Honda's Asimo, who could walk, run, and even dance, if you like a robot that moves like a penguin with two left feet. Then there was Boston Dynamics Atlas, an acrobat in metal who could do backflips but probably wouldn't make a great butler, unless your idea of cleaning involves doing Parker over the furniture. So, why have these robots not made it into our homes? Here comes Neo Beta. A robot by OpenAI-backed Norway's 1X Technologies aims to change all of that. Neo Beta is not just any robot. Standing at 5.4 feet and weighing 66 pounds, it has a unique muscle-like anatomy. Think less Iron Man and more flexible yoga instructor. Instead of stiff hydraulics, Neo Beta is all about balance, strength and flexibility, power, and a gentle touch. This means it can carefully give you a warm handshake if you stretch your hand. So how does Neo Beta actually differ from the likes of ASIMO or Atlas? Let's start with ASIMO. By the way, ASIMO stands for Advanced Step in Innovative Mobility. The acronym was derived from the Japanese word ASI, which loosely translates to foot or leg. ASIMO was a big deal back in the day. It could walk, climb stairs, even wave hello like a celebrity trying to look casual. But here's the catch. ASIMO was a bit of a diva. It needed perfectly flat surfaces, ideal conditions, and let's be honest, way too much attention to do its tricks. It was like having a high-maintenance pet that needed constant supervision. And then, there was Sophia, the robot that tried really hard to be human, a little too hard, some might say. With her awkward expressions and cryptic comments, she was more famous for looking like a nervous guest on a late-night talk show than for doing anything useful around the house. Yes, she had citizenship in Saudi Arabia, but we never saw her wash a single dish. Meanwhile, Boston Dynamics Atlas is out here flexing, literally. Sure, Atlas can do backflips, run, jump, and do all sorts of impressive acrobatics, but let's face it, no one needs a robot that could just out-gymnast Simone Biles. We need robots that can handle groceries, not gymnastics. Plus, with its weight, one misstep from Atlas, and suddenly, your living room looks like a demolition site. This is where Neo Beta aims to make its mark. Designed for everyday home environments, Neo Beta is a humble overachiever. It's equipped with a soft exterior and no sharp edges, so it's less likely to cause damage if it bumps into you. And unlike previous robots that have been built like tanks, Neo Beta's foam-wrapped body makes it a lot less terrifying to have around. And if that's not enough, this robot loves hugs. It might just be the first humanoid to ever crave a good cuddle. But there's more to Neo Beta than just its friendly design. Underneath its soft exterior lies a sophisticated AI powered by the latest machine learning algorithms. Neo Beta uses a form of embodied learning, which means it learns from every experience, continuously adapting to new environments, whether navigating a crowded kitchen or recognizing different family members. Neo Beta is one of the first consumer robots to edge closer to artificial general intelligence, a type of AI that can perform any intellectual task a human can. While is not quite there yet, Neo Beta's ability to adapt to new scenarios, learn from interactions, and perform complex tasks like reaching over a sofa to plug in a cable is a step toward more advanced, human-like intelligence. Neo Beta aims to strike a balance between practicality and social interaction. It's not trying to win America's Got Talent with a stand-up comedy routine like Sophia. Instead, it focuses on doing what really matters, like picking up after you or lending a hand with heavy lifting. But will Neo Beta succeed where others have face planted? One X Technology CEO Bernd Bornick says, Safety is our top priority. This year, we are deploying Neo Beta into selected homes to gather essential feedback and demonstrate its capabilities in real world settings. We believe this is the next step in bringing humanoid robots into everyday life. It's a bold move, backed by some serious confidence. One X Technologies is targeting a price point comparable to a small car. But unlike that hatchback, Neo Beta won't need oil changes, just maybe a software update or two. And let's not get ahead of ourselves. Neo Beta is promising, but it's got a lot to prove. Will it actually become the first household robot we can't live without, or is it just another gimmicky gizmo destined to collect dust next to your unused treadmill? Time will tell. Meanwhile, what do you think? Is Neo Beta the future of home robotics or just another interesting prototype? Drop your thoughts in the comments. Hit that like button and make sure to subscribe for more on the latest in robotics and tech.